हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई होप यू आर फीलिंग वेल प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर दिस वीडियो एंड आई हैव अ रिक्वेस्ट टू यू ऑल सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल टू मैनी व्यूवर्स वाचिंग माय वीडियोस विदाउट सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल सो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल एंड वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल एंड फॉर स्पोर्टिंग मी सो लेट स्टार्ट टू द इन्फॉर्मेशन दीज आर सम अपडेट्स ऑन दिन आर the imf report it was a great report i think there were some negatives in there the reason for the negatives is because they are implementing some massive changes and because of that you are not going to have a bunch of great numbers they went from a multi currency practice to a single currency practice not only that they went digital all of this is necessary for their new currency for their rv for them to go international I saw nothing bad in that report. Recommendations the IMF gave are fantastic. Iraq is already ahead of the game on it and I'd even say rounding third base on a lot of those recommendations. So far so good. There isn't a back wall date but I know what their targets are. And things appear to be well on track for meeting them. My redemption folks are expecting a very busy week this week and weekend. they very much believe it will happen this week somewhere over the next few days i hope this is accurate state forces receive draft budget and parliamentary signatures to pass it this week some of the mainstream news says it will be voted on this thursday oil surges after saudis make additional 1 million bpd voluntary production cut to me this is important because iraq's value is affected by oil I think this may be a move to help support Iraq's value. The IMF said to the CBI and Sadani, "Get your budget out now." Why? Because it has the markers, evidence, reasons for a new exchange rate and international currency. So the IMF came out last week and told the CBI and Sadani, "Will you please open your budget instead of the same old mantra? Raise the value of your currency." Now it's Will you please open your budget because you're dealing with a recession? At this moment if you are buying something, the smallest denomination in Iraq is a 250 note. So if something costs 350, how are you going to get that product without giving them a 500? You are going to lose little bit of money on that because there's no change. That's inflationary. If you find they adjusted the exchange rate and you don't have any small category notes or fees, it's going to get worse if they can support the dinar with all the commercial merchants throughout the country with electronic pos it's going to create what demand for their currency that's how the currency will gain value this is what's happening behind closed doors the kurdistan dispute we know you want to hear good news however good news doesn't always facilitate our investment goals As investors we need to understand what's holding up the currency value. Turkey has put a dent in Iraq's agenda. However, Iraq started the domino effect over 5 years ago. When they sued Turkey in international courts for allowing KRG oil to pass through the Kayan port in Turkey without Baghdad's permission. Iraq won the lawsuit and it made Turkey so angry they closed down the oil pipeline. The bottom line is Iraq is losing billions in revenue. Revenue the country needs to climb out of the downturn the economy from the world health crisis and war.